Franklin. We're here today with uh, Blake Mejia of the Union Redskins, and Blake has committed to the uh, University of Tulsa. Let's talk about that. Um, do, did you have any other uh, recruiting offers, and, and why Tulsa? Um, the University of Memphis offered me, and uh, the University of New Mexico. And, and uh, I remember that you committed uh, like a day after Dalton Rodriguez, a teammate, changed his commitment. Did um, I think we were you were saying it didn't influence your commitment? But uh, tell something about that. Um, well, the weekend before, um, I took my official visit to TU, and I really enjoyed it. And um, Coach Johnson, the line coach, he. Uh, he told me that he was going to come to the house for in-home visit the next Thursday, and I thought, oh, I really like to you. I think it's probably the best place for him, best fit. So I made up my head, I'll just commit Thursday. And Dalton just happened to commit the day before, so probably a lot of people probably thought that was my influence. But I mean, I don't want to say it wasn't, but I mean, he's also my great teammate, great friend. So I was pretty excited for us to be on the same team in college. So, yeah. What do you like the most about uh, being an offensive lineman, blocking? Um, well, just dominating somebody by just, you know, moving them somewhere they don't want to be. Just, just, I don't know, just, 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 just get satisfaction from it, which is awesome. Of course, you can't <laughs> pick them up and put them where they Not necessarily, be. no. you got to <laughs> drive your feet, move them, move them out of the way. Um, Coach said he can't remember um, a, tie, a lineman he's had that had more highlight reel type blocks. Um, do you remember one in particular or a, or a game in particular? Um, I've had several games I can remember, but um, one block that I remember the most was um, we were playing Ponca City. And, um, it was my junior year. I was playing um, left guard at the time. And I had a, it was a pulling play, so I was pulling. And this kid just ran straight up the field, didn't even see me. And I just hit him from the side and thought I'd knock him out. But, Pretty hard hit, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Pretty hard hit? Yeah, he took a while for him to get back up. <laughs> did you see little stars over his head? Uh, I thought I did, a couple. <laughs> <laughs> um, you, you, you played, you started at left guard this year, but you moved to left tackle, and I, it makes me think of Michael Ower and, and the blind side. Was it, was it cool that they made a movie about an offensive tackle? Um, yeah, it was a pretty cool movie. I enjoyed it, but it's like probably the first movie I've ever known about a movie about offensive linemen. So I guess it's pretty good to get our, you know, our kind of glory. <laughs> kind of striking a blow for for linemen. That's right. Yeah. Uh, were you uh, had to, Were you happy with the way the Super Bowl came out? Yes, actually, I was. I was going for the Ravens because um, Ray Lewis and um. The actual left tackle for the Ravens, too, Bryant McKinney. He's actually one of my favorite guys in the NFL, so favorite lineman, actually. Um, what do you think about, uh, obviously, going to TU, Coach Blankenship, an old Union, Union high head coach. What about his impact on, on the TU program and, and Tulsa football in general? Um, I think it's a, like a huge impact because, you know, he was the former head coach before, a fellow before the, I don't remember his name, Coach Wright. Came from, I think, Iowa, I'm not sure. But he's bringing the Union way to TU, and it's a great program. We're going to do big things in the next couple of years, so pretty excited.